I'm Yuki Washington with your evening digital news brief for Monday, March 1st, 2021. Philadelphia is now easing some COVID-19 restrictions in the city. Effective today, 2,500 total people will be allowed for outdoor events. Retail stores can increase their capacity to 20 people per 1,000 square feet. Religious services can increase to 20% capacity, and there are also changes for outdoor dining. Up to six people will be allowed per table outdoors, and they will not be required to be from the same household. Johnson & Johnson is shipping out the first four million doses of its coronavirus vaccine. The CDC and FDA approved its emergency use over the weekend. It's the first single-dose vaccine. While it's slightly less effective than the Pfizer and Moderna shots, overall, the Johnson & Johnson vaccine proved to be 85% effective at preventing severe illness. More than 200 Marines and U.S. Navy sailors have arrived in Philadelphia to help support FEMA's mass vaccination site. Defense Department photos show a team of mass military members at the Pennsylvania Convention Center. The Center City Vaccination Center opens Wednesday. The goal is to provide around 6,000 doses a day to Philadelphia residents. The FEMA site will be appointment only. People interested in getting a vaccine will need to sign up through the City Health Department. Virtual Health marked a milestone on Saturday. The health system delivered its 100,000th vaccine dose. It happened at the Burlington County Vaccine Mega Site in Morristown. The health system started vaccinating health care workers in December, and Virtua said it regularly vaccinates between 3,000 and 4,000 people a day at the mega site. Remember, you can always get the latest on these stories and much more here at CBSPhilly.com and on our streaming service, CBSN Philly. That is the latest for the evening digital brief. I'm Yuki Washington.